I have with my team a lot of systems. One of them is for checking to free. In this system, I have some priorities. Of course, for me, it's important the communication and very easily positioning. We have here two wingers in the front. We have here, of course, center and defenders. For me, it's important in the system to free passive that we are waiting on the opponent. For me, it's important to win the puck in this area. To win the puck in this area, and of course, if you do that, you can bounce back. If this defender's got a puck and he can make a breakout on his own, we just wanna go aggressively. Or if the defender just let the puck to be and he starts, we go a little bit backwards, keep the positioning and in this moment attack, go, attack. Sometimes happens that this player plays a drop pass if he does it. He has to go but sometimes he just try to skate over we just wanna cut the ice so the puck is here defender support this player goes here and this player goes here big advantage is we have all the time three players behind and we win the puck actually right now in this moment in this position of course, whatever you do, important are skills, timing, and of course, communication. Now we have the same situation, we are going to take a look at on slow motion. You see here the player on the right side skating a lot. He has to keep his position. Now the position is actually right, we have defenders on the boards in the middle east center, relative high, they should go a little bit low. Now opponent does a breakout. Very good forecheck of the player number 13. And now we see that the pass comes into the middle. That's great, but technical mistake of the center. Now white opponent has got a very good speed. It's very tough for the defenders to stop them and they've got a goal chance. Good for checking, but individual mistake. In the second situation, we take a look on very bad for checking. We see the left winger going actually aggressively or not against the winger on the right board or left board from view. Now you see the middle is free. Mistake of the right winger. And right now we give up the middle. We give up the middle. It's very tough to stop the opponent in the speed. Now we are late on the man. We lose 1-1 one -one situation, no communication. Right now we see it's actually situation three against two. In the final situation, two against one. Great save from Mongoli. Cannot happen. Key points of passive for checking two, three. Communication. Stay in the line, don't give up the middle. 
for us is important if the game goes this way. Go, support, support, go behind the D, go here in the middle. Now we have the puck, no more chance. Of course, if happens that the puck goes this way, no problem. Just take a new organization, new organization, two, three, speak. Maybe we can change the positioning, but we are still too free. Don't forget, for us it's important, or it's very important, to keep the zone. Stay passive, but start to work, really start to work from this line. If you don't, the opponent get a speed. We have to keep the line, no pass opportunity. The only one thing that the opponent can do is just to bring the puck on the boards dump. But it's delayed because here we have directly contact and they have actually no time. Whatever you do, do it right. Doesn't matter if you have a four checking three two, one one three one three one. But do it right. Thank you very much for your attention.